What about the the run? You took him in the mountains. We're going to walk up or something. But yeah, we uh, there was a run, there was a run that we used to do in Marbella called the Istan Mountain, and I thought to myself, he was on a ketogenic diet at this point, and I thought to myself, we don't need to run up it again. Intensity he hasn't got to be mad at the minute like the boxers do like for their fight camp. I'm thinking, let's just take a walk up it. One of the fellas can drive in the car, walk up, drive back down. Good workout, but not too intense. So he got out of the car, stretching. I'm thinking, whatever this lunatic doing, a little loosing himself up, boom, starts jogging. I thought, it's going to last five minutes here, and then he'll start walking. Anyway, keeps going. Five minutes later, I'm thinking, it won't be too much longer. Keeps going. Won't be too much longer, keeps going. The whole way up. Then start sprinting halfway through. What I'm thinking, this fella's off. He's trolling <laughs> here. Got a few young lads around him as well. Then he's pushing them on. Then I was like, right, we're at, we're at the top now. Once we was there, and uh, he went, is this where everyone stops? Yeah, I went, yeah. He went, the Gypsy King don't stop here. Then he went, we're going all the way up to the top. So he just had to do that little bit more than everybody else. And I thought, there's something about him, not boxing ability, but there's something about him in there. And up there. Yeah, that's what separates the weak from the strong. I believe, though, that that's how he's made the comeback that he's done to 100%. be the, the most spoke about boxer on the planet just now.